this is our view right outside our hotel room. It's fantastic. River flowing down. There's people river rafting. That's fun. That's not us. We're leaving early. <laughs> early. Like 15 minutes before checkout. You'll notice, I just wanted to say this, um, I'm wearing like the same color shirt I was wearing yesterday, but there's no coffee stain on this one. Not, what the hell? What the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I just pulled it. It was clean, I swear. Here we go. On the road again. Yeah. 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 Bridge. So where are we headed now? Uh, Roslyn and then Ellensburg. Roslyn and Ellensburg. That's on today's agenda. Mm, happy Wednesday, everybody. That's all about. And uh, I saw that the population was 912. <laughs> 914 now with us. Lovely little place. On Northern Exposure, the Roslyn Cafe is where they used to go and have like lunch and stuff. 25 years ago, there used to be a TV show called Northern Exposure. Uh, this was the, the town where they filmed some of it. Or a lot of it. I think most of it. Some, eh, you know, it was TV. You never know. But uh, the cafe. So we could totally go to the museum. Yeah. Except it's not open on Wednesdays. And today is? Wednesday. Happy Wednesday, everybody. Okay. So we can just walk down the street and then get in the car and go. Yes. <laughs> we'll look in the museum. It's right next door. So if you're wondering... If you're wondering... What is Rosin all about? Well, it was settled as a coal mining town back in like the 1880s. You know how I know this? Hang on. There's, there's like coal. That's like coal cars. It's like a coal... You know, coal stuff. Think of like the seven dwarfs. But I know because it says right here. Welcome to another little bit of history from Wayne. I was just telling the people that Roslyn was founded as a coal mining town. Yeah, it was. See, she agrees. I can read too. Apparently the story of the day in Roslyn is um, Wednesdays, nothing's open. <laughs> is it that late? It's not that late. It's only it like... It was like 2 o'clock. Everything's closed. <laughs> Except for the coffee shop. We got coffee from the uh, Roslyn Cafe. Mm. The Motel 6. That'll hey. be home for the night. Who <laughs> loves you, baby? <laughs> Classy sleeping. There's a pool that we're not going to use. Welcome to Ellensburg. There's the pool. Was that? Did you sound excited? No. Oh. <laughs> oh, good lord. It smells like murder. Sounds like murder. <laughs> at least, at least the carpet's clean. Yeah, they put like a, you know, laminate down. That's nice. Does, does the toilet have the, like the little tape on it that says clean? No, and it's not really that clean. 
All right, that's okay. It's a bed for the night. We're good. I said it was an endorsement. But I'm not dissing it. It's air conditioned. Were you running that when I said the toilet's not clean? Yeah. I might have been a little bit unfair with uh, with sort of dissing Motel 6. I was not dissing Motel 6. Um, here's what I learned. It started in like the 60s and it used to cost six bucks a night. Motel 6, six dollars, which I think back then it was probably, I don't know, 50 bucks a night, which is pretty good. They're kind of built for the traveler. People just kind of on the road trip going through, coming and going. Um, and they used to have the biggest complaints about their bathroom and their um, dirty carpets. So the bathroom, I guess, they're still working on. The dirty carpets been replaced by the laminate floor, and they started this whole renovation thing in like 2008. It's been a while since I've been to a Motel 6, but I imagine they all look exactly like this. I'll, I was just picking up on the Motel 6 thing. Yeah. It's special. some old stuff. I don't know if I'd really call it westerny right now at this point in time. Although there is a rodeo here every every uh, Labor Day. Labor Day. I was gonna say May. It's September. You know. Uh, we're still looking for the western theme. It is a cool little town. That's for sure. Frontier, yeah, I'd give it that. I'd give it the Frontier thing. It's kind of part of the Old West, 100, 150 years old. Uh, very outdoorsy. Lots of outdoor shops and coffee. Coffee like crazy. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad we're staying in. It's like a lightning storm and stuff. It's like crazy. And it's raining. This is so fun. Turn it off. <laughs> Everyone go to sleep. Be safe. How's the water pressure? I think it's great. I'm going to have to shower in it tomorrow. That's uh, Shit. impressive. <laughs>